Hi everyone! Welcome back to another weekly craft video. My name is Tori and I'm your Makerspace Librarian. The library offers a new take and make craft kit every week. Just stop by the library, grab your kit, and follow along with the craft video. You can find all of our videos on our Facebook page and YouTube channel. Make sure you subscribe so that you don't miss out on any library events. Visit whitewaterlibrary.org for links to our social media pages, updated library hours, and upcoming library programs and events. This week we have a craft for adults, but anybody who wishes to participate is welcome to. This week we are going to be making these beautiful sun catchers. So you hang it in a window and the little crystal down here at the end catches the sun and throws beautiful rainbows all across your room. These are very simple to make, but they are very beautiful. So let's get started. In your craft kit this week, you're going to get 10 inches of beading wire and a little cup that has some beads, some crimp tubes, and a little crystal that's gonna hang off the end of your sun catcher. At home, you will need a pair of needle nose pliers, some scissors, and you may also want to grab a tray or a plate to put your beads on. To make this sun catcher, I used 10 beads of each color. So 10 red, 10 orange, yellow, green, blue, and purple. So you're gonna get one crystal, two of these little silver crimp tubes and enough beads to complete your project. First, I'm going to add my crystal to the end of my wire. I'm gonna grab one of my crimp tubes and thread it through. And then I'm gonna do the same with my little crystal here. And then I'm gonna bring the end of the wire back up and through the crimp tube as well. Just like that. Now when I have it positioned the way I want it, I'm going to use my needle nose pliers to squeeze pretty hard on this crimp tube so that it closes over the wire and holds it in place. Tug on the wire to make sure that the crimp tube is holding your crystal in place. If it slips at all, just give it another squeeze. Now I'm going to trim off that little piece of wire. Now I'm ready to start adding the beads. You can add your beads in whatever order you would like. So thread your final tube like that and then bring the excess wire back down through the tube again so that it creates a little loop at the top. 
You can adjust your loop to whatever size you would like, depending on where you're going to hang it, what you're going to hang it on. And then when you're ready and you like the size, just go ahead and give it a good squeeze with a pair of needle nose pliers. Give it a tug to make sure that it's holding tight and trim off this little bit of wire. Hang your sun catcher in a sunny spot in your home. I hope you enjoyed this week's craft. If you complete this activity, please share your photos with us. We love to see your completed projects. Bye.